I don't know what that guy's thinking. And to be perfectly honest, I never know what he's thinking. He's, his ignorance is his bliss, and that's plain and simple. I think that that's his biggest power, is he's so, he's telling himself all these positive things. He's got people in his ear telling him these positive things. You hit hard, you're athletic, you're too fast, you're this, you're that. And he listens to it, and he believes it, because he's had some knockouts in his pro career so far against guys that have been in the top 20. So, that being said, his ignorance is his peace. That's his bliss, that's where he gets his strength. He's got this self-perceived image of himself of one, to be an alpha, so he's got to perceive that, he's got to put that out there to everybody, he's got to be real loud about it. And two, to also be a savage in his own head. I'm a savage, I'm a savage, I'm, I'm going to break your jaw, I'm crazy, I've got, you know, I got loud tattoos, I act crazy, I look mean, I'm mad, I got dad issues, all this stuff. So he's got to portray that, he's got to put that show on for all you guys. I mean, that's what makes him look tough. For me, I'm going to be me, I'm going to be myself. He wants to act that way, he can, but we've got a date. The fight's happening. None of those guys have a clue what to do with me, so there's nothing they can tell him. And he's gonna figure that out after the first round when he's in there punching, he's in there missing, he's looking for that big punch that he's landed on everybody else, and he goes to land that punch, and I'm gone. I'm a ghost, I'm not there. And then he goes to do it again, and I'm gone, and I'm not there, and then he's getting hit, and he's getting hit. And when he goes and sits on that stool after the first round, and he looks at his corners, he's gonna know his corners, have nothing they can tell him. I've fought them for 27 plus rounds. I've maybe lost five rounds of those rounds against the corners that he's gonna have there, against his teammates, the teammates that I've made a living off of, Team Alpha Fail, so bring it, let's how, go. How much confidence does it give you, the fact that you beat them so many times? It's just another guy, it's just another fighter, man. I've done this so many times. How many people grow up getting into fights? I grew up getting into fights all the time. And every time I got into a fight on the street, every time I got into a fight, in Tucson, Arizona, in my hometown where I grew up. They didn't like me. They said a lot of mean things about me before it happened. And I went out there and had to do what I had to do to them on the street. What's the difference of this really, other than now I've got all these media outlets covering it and making it a bigger deal than it is. Really, this is just a fight. And if it was on the street, I would have already done it. So it's already done in my eyes.